When you stick your circle hook in through your bait, be sure to check it as it comes out the other side. See how the scale has gotten on the tip? If you're not paying attention and you uh, leave it like that, that fish is not going to get hooked. Make sure you remove all the scales. All right, now that we've got all our rods out, we're just waiting on the catfish. I'm going to talk a little bit about some of the equipment I use. We get a lot of requests from my videos, guys asking what kind of rods I'm using, what kind of hooks am I using, what kind of line. Well, I'm going to start with the hooks. I use a Demon Circle hook made by Mustad. It's an ultra point, fine wire. Uh, the circle hooks are a little, little different than a regular hook. You cannot, cannot set the hook on a circle hook. You've got to let the catfish take the bait, take the hook, and it will hook itself. Uh, one, one thing that, that you may notice on some hooks, some of them are offset. This particular one is not offset. It's straight as you can see. But what I like to do is, is offset that a little bit. It helps me get a better hook up. And what I'll do is just grab it with the pliers. Don't touch the point with the pliers because you'll, you'll dull it and just take a good twist on it. Might have to do it a couple times. But now if you look at that hook, it's an offset. And that'll give you a, a whole lot better hook set. It's important when you use a, a circle hook is to choose a rod that has a soft tip. And what I mean by that, maybe a fast action, softer tip. You don't want anything real stiff because that's just like setting the hook on a, on a circle hook. That's a no-no. Cannot set the hook on a circle hook. Let the fish bend the pole, load the pole, and he'll hook himself. But uh, a good rod is essential with, with a good circle hook. For my rods, I like the Tangling with Catfish rods. You can check them out at tanglingwithcatfish.com. Great company. The guys who own it fish throughout the United States and the Cabela's King Cat and other tournaments. Uh, but they designed this rod with a fast action tip so it will load up on the fish and help sink that circle hook into the side of the, the catfish's mouth. It's just uh, the, the circle hook and tangling with catfish rod kind of go hand in hand. It's probably some of the best outfits I've seen. If you kind of look at the tip of this, you'll see about 18 inches to two foot is kind of a fast action. You see it bending right there, but once it gets loaded up and the fish is hooked, the backbone from here to the handle will give you better control over the fish. You'll be able to pull him where you want him, put him where you want him. Uh, but the, the important thing with, the, with setting this circle hook is this fast action tip. Tangling with catfish rods, I've used them for about four or five years now. Uh, great rod. They have a all stainless steel eyes, cork handle, aluminum reel seat. I, I'd seriously be lost without this rod. It's lightweight and I've seen fish over 100 pounds be caught on this on this particular rod. But the Tangled Catfish rods are probably the best rod in my opinion for uh, catfishing and circle hooks. The reels that I like to use are the Cat Max reels from Bass Pro Shops. It's an inexpensive reel, but it holds up to, to big fish. I've never had a problem with them. I bought some about eight years ago. I had to replace them last year, so they lasted me eight years. And I fish hard with them, so they, if they'll hold up for eight years, they're, they're pretty good in my book. Now, another little reel that, that I've obtained through winning it in a tournament is a Ming Yang CL60. Uh, this is a nice little reel. I won this in a tournament one time. Didn't think much of it, but I put it on the rod just to see what it was gonna do. And it's, it's lasted me over a year. I've never had a problem with it. Uh, it's a very inexpensive reel for, for guys that just wanna get started. And you can get this exclusively at uh, renegadetackle.com. Uh, Renegade's got about everything you need for catfishing. Hooks, rods, sinkers, sinker bumpers, anything you need for catfishing, 
Renegade Tackle's got it. So check them out. Real down, honey. And then pull him out of the rod right holder. He's not a very big one, but. Old pesky channel cat. Check that mud out on that belly. We've been struggling to catch fish today. And that mud kind of tells why. They just, I guess the high pressure come through. The water dropping two foot while we're here today probably didn't help things either. But we got on a couple fish. That's a pretty nice little channel cat right there. That's kind of big for the Ohio River in my neck of the woods here. <laughs> 